Bandsaw Crown Music here. Hope you're doing well. Today I have a sound design tutorial to create an ARP that sounds something like this. There are a few factors involved in making a sound like this. This time I won't be starting from scratch because uh, it would just take too long. But I am making this preset available for a free download for you. Link in the description below. Okay, let's for the moment just switch off the mini stop effect and turn the oscillator window. Let's just use a simple saw wave to demonstrate for the moment. Now let's have a look at the mini stop effect. Let's just play the ARP sequence without it on. And let's activate the effect and listen to it now. So you can hear at the end of the ARP, there's some kind of I don't know, pitch down effect that's happening there as the sound actually goes into stop mode. So you can see on the right hand side here in the mod matrix, I've got the mod envelope um, attached to this mini stop, uh, which is at slot six in the FX chain. And that is controlling what's happening there. Let's have a closer look at the mod envelope. So you can see here, what I'm saying with this envelope here is at the end of the fourth bar, do something. And that something is to invoke or activate the mini stop effect. But you can see that I'm only activating the mini stop effect for half a bar here, so the sound doesn't fully stop. Again, this just adds a lot more interest and life to the sound. So if you don't know how to create this envelope, it's quite easy. Okay, um, you simply, you have the four bars here by default. You double click to add a point like this. I'm gonna add a few points here. So halfway through the fourth bar, I'm gonna activate it. Straight up, sometimes click and drag, next to have a curve into it, like that. And then what I do is uh, I um, click on the six dots and I drag it over to the stop button here and I release. And over in the mod matrix here, um, I just turn it all the way up. Um, there you go, that's activating it. So that's how you make an envelope in the mod envelope section and attach it to the mini stop effect. Other things I've got going on here, you can see the cutoff filter. There's an LFO attached to it. Let's just turn off the effects here for a moment so we can hear what the LFO module is doing. Turn off the mini stop. Let's have a listen. Now with it off, you can hear there's far less movement in the sound. And to me, it's less interesting. Let's turn it back on. Okay, feel free to explore for yourself what sounds you can put on this oscillator. I've got a simple saw wave, but there are some really interesting sounds, especially in the wavetable section of Avenger. I like using wavetables because it does give the sound a bit more life to it, because the sound is actually scanning through a wavetable and changing over time. Here are a few examples of wavetables which I've found that actually work well with this. Sign Pitch Traveler was something I liked. So over tone cycle one. That's a good one. Synthesis Spectra. Next complex waves. Okay, that's about it for today. I hope you found it helpful. If you have found it helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe for more VPS Avenger tutorials. Again, the download link for this preset is in the description. If you need advice on how to install individual presets in Avenger, I also did a video on that on my YouTube channel as well. Okay, that's it. I'll see you next time. Cheers. Mm -hmm.